The M is, Behavior of Markets by Benoit B. Mandelbrot and Richard L. Hudson, Holes in the Safety Nets. Welcome to your book summary.com. The study of risk in finance began with Louis Bachelier's analysis of Paris bourse prices in the early 1900s. He determined that prices changed unpredictably but could be analyzed using probability math. Building on Bachelier's work, economist Eugene Fama proposed the efficient markets hypothesis. This hypothesis states that prices incorporate all relevant information and only change in response to new information. Therefore, it is possible to beat the market. The efficient markets hypothesis is one of three pillars supporting contemporary financial orthodoxy. The capital asset pricing model simplified Markowitz's calculations by offering a single variable to express a stock's level of risk. Markowitz and Sharp received Nobel Prizes for designing efficient portfolios that would deliver the highest return for a given level of risk. Other pioneers of securities market risk were Myron S. Scholes and Fisher Black, who collaborated to develop the Black-Scholes option pricing formula. This formula allows traders and investors to control the level of risk by using options as insurance. The scholar's work holds value but needs to improve. When critics like Mandelbrot pointed out these weaknesses, defenders of orthodoxy merely invented various patches. For example, long-term dependence causes cluster volatility, and the risk distribution does not follow a bell curve. Acknowledging long-term dependence would threaten the foundations of financial orthodoxy, randomness wouldn't be what it has been assumed. Financial experts have relied on outdated and insufficient theories and have patched them with statistical techniques like generalized autoregressive conditional heteroskedasticity GRCH, instead of using multifractal market analysis. Garch adjusts parameters to maintain a normal probability curve that grows or shrinks to deal with increases or decreases in volatility. However, these patches are inferior science and have caused the world to come close to financial disaster numerous times in recent decades. The simplest explanation for the widest range of phenomena is the best science. Instead of new patches, the financial world needs a new model, the multifractal model. I hope you found the information about the them is, behavior of markets by Ben Wabi, Mandelbrot and Richard L. Hudson. If you're interested in learning more about the book, stay tuned for the next part of this series where we'll dive into the next section. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.